it has been intensely windy all day long so if you can hear any of that I'm just gonna have to ask you to ignore it because I don't think it's gonna stop anytime soon hello friend I'm glad that you had a good weekend with all of your travels and things I also had a good weekend but I did not go anywhere I stayed home but it was a good weekend. Nothing really exciting happened, but chill days are nice sometimes. It's nice to have a break from all of the excitement now and then. The only downside to not having an eventful weekend is that I don't really have any adventures to tell you about or anything exciting to talk about at all. So what I'm going to do is tell you about a project that I recently started. I don't think I've talked about this in a video yet. Although, the last week has kind of been a blur of activity of very mundane variety, which I will get to in a second. But, yeah. I don't think I've talked about this. If I have, oops. But, yeah. Anyway. Uh, what I've been doing, I started, it's been a week since I started this. I started this on Tuesday of last week. Uh, I have started doing what's called bullet journaling. I was looking for something to kind of kick my life into gear. And it just so happened that a YouTuber that I really, really like, uh, Dodie Clark, uh, she's she's awesome. If you don't watch her videos, you should. She's got two channels. She's doing, like, an everyday vlog thing this month. It Yeah. Go check her out. She's cool. Anyway, <laughs> she was talking about, she's been doing bullet journaling, and it just so happened that literally the night that I was looking for a way to organize all of the stuff that I want to try and get done every day, she uploaded a video talking about bullet journaling and so then I started watching other videos that people had put up about bullet journaling and figuring out what exactly it was and how to do it and yeah I am really loving this format this is my journal this journal actually fun fact came from a NaNoWriMo participant I signed up one year for the NaNoWriMo care package swap thing and this was one of the things that my swap partner sent me was this Lovely, lovely journal. Beautiful shade of purple. Mm, it's clouding over. I don't know how I feel. It's probably going to be raining by the time I go to work. Again. Ugh. Where you list off all the things that you need to get done for the day. I like to do mine. I set it up the night before. And then you use a little single bullet for uh, tasks, things that you need to get done. Circles for events. And then like a little dash if there's notes you want to make or like things you need to remember or write down or whatever. I haven't really made use of that. I put some quotes down in it at one point. But then as you do the stuff, you check off the stuff that you've done during the day. They call it rapid logging. And so if stuff happens that you get done or that like events happen, then you just like mark them in here. But I'm really enjoying this format of journaling. I also have a list that I've been keeping in the front cover of things that I want to start doing like every day or things that I want to organize so I can start doing like weekly or monthly or whatever. Just things that I need to uh, keep track of but I haven't applied yet. So yeah, I'm really loving this way of doing things. It makes it really easy for me to keep track of stuff and it's harder for me to get distracted with other things like I tried that habit website where it's like a game it ended up being more overwhelming than fun so I had to quit that I made a really big effort at having a personal calendar last year and it did not work out but this I can handle uh, I keep a notebook with me at all times and sticking this tiny little journal in there with it is not a big deal so yeah I don't know it's just it's working really well uh, and I'm, I'm pretty happy with how it's been turning out. I just hope that I can keep it up. If I can keep powering through until it just kind of takes hold, and I'll be doing good. So, yeah. It is getting windier and more overcast, and I suspect a storm is coming in. So I'm going to probably close up some of these open windows that I have for light and such so that if it starts to thunderstorm nothing will come in the windows at me so <laughs> yeah I'm gonna go and I will see you tomorrow my friend goodbye